Hello, it's Michael E. Gerber, and it's the Michael E. Gerber Show. And I'm here with my guest, John Souza. Hello, John. Hello, Michael. How are you? I'm absolutely delightful. <laughs> So tell me a little bit about you and your company. I graduated from business school and then over the next 10 years, I worked for three of the top investment firms. And what I learned during this time is that by leveraging my relationships, I was able to expand my presence. And by doing so, I really achieved significant results. And if you fast forward now to 2011, in this new social media world, the most important thing nowadays is to expand your presence and become as visible as possible. So it's really been a natural progression. So now I'm the CEO and founder of Social Media Magic, which is a social media training provider and done-for-you solutions firm. And we even just recently got recognized as one of the top five social media firms for business, according to Mashable. Really? Well, that's cool. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, so it's very, very exciting. So tell me what a social media firm is. Well, social media firm, we have, we have really two core strengths of our company. And we have the training side and we have the done for you services side. Done for you services side. That's correct. We, right. we, we manage social media programs on behalf of companies of really all sizes. And when you look at the training side, our goals are very simple. Is that we want you to go to the trainings and do three things. We want you to listen, we want you to learn, and we want you to be able to implement what you learned immediately. And this is where a lot of people don't get it right. On the done for you services side, we handle companies from very, very small to one of our largest companies, which is SAP, which is really the largest wow. enterprise software company in the world. But the similarities between these small and large companies is the same. Companies and individuals want to be set apart as a subject matter expert, market leader, thought leader in their domain of expertise, whether that's for brand awareness purposes and or revenue generation purposes. Absolutely. So help me understand what do you do uniquely, but I want you to d speak about the very, very small company, simply because that's the arena that I've been playing in so I can better uh, translate. Well, when you look at this, I mean, the, the majority of clients that come to us on, on either the training side or the done for you services, they always wonder, how do I do this? There's so many people out there that are calling themselves so-called social media experts. Right. They say, you need a social media strategy, you need an online brand, but they tell you about this, but they don't give you exact instructions how to achieve this. Yes. And what we do, either within the done for you services on social media magic or the training purposes or the training program, Social Media Marketing University, is that we not only tell you, we show you step by step how to achieve success in social media for real results that are tangential to exactly your target market. Okay, so uh, let me translate that. <laughs> let me translate that. We got a lot of people listening. Lots of people in business, lots of people know about social media. Yes, absolutely. You know, they know um, Facebook, they know Twitter, they know et cetera and so forth. But what you're doing essentially is turning those assets into true assets. Correct. To truly make them work for your client. Exactly. You know your mission of your company. What we do, we understand who you are, who your target market is, what the triggers of your target market, and then we represent these companies on the done for you side effectively and efficiently online to great success, or we can show you how to do it yourself without really, the, there's so much noise and so much clutter in the social media world, we provide clarity within that clutter. That's very, very cool. Because yes, there is a lot of noise. Exactly. And yes, there is a lot of confusion. And the more that happens in the social media environment, the more chaos there will be. Correct, and it's ever changing. It, Continuously, so you stay abreast of it. Absolutely. You stay clear about it. Correct. You very, very clearly define what it is that must be done if a client is going to achieve a result that they say they wish to achieve, or you help them to better understand the result and the path to achieving it. Absolutely. I mean, and you can either do it for them, or you can teach them how. Absolutely, and, and that's what we've been very successful with the Social Media Marketing University program. We've had over 2,500 graduates to date, of which many have gone on to become certified social media strategists, and many of these people even have their own social media companies nowadays. Mm. And, and when you look at this, in addition to, we've run uh, free webinars on a weekly basis that 60,000 people have really uh, attended to date, which is probably the, the most successful training program in, exi in its existence today because people wow. have a need for learning and they have a need for implementable advice, not just telling you how great they are or how great Facebook or LinkedIn right. or Twitter are. Of course. So help me to understand, you're in a new marketplace called social media. Yes. I think of it as, but I'm an old guy. <laughs> um, so we might have some old guys out there just like me who think social media, well, social media, you know, there's sort of this iffy proposition about, yeah, right, I, I know Facebook has a gazillion people um, 
with friends and so forth and so on. But how do you turn that into actionable opportunities? You have to look at it in a very simple standpoint. Is that it, it, you know you're obviously a business expert. But there's a lot of people out there that are very good at what they do, but they don't know how to convey it to an audience. They don't have that database. They don't have that reach. So what we do, everybody's benefited by very simple ways, is that if I, if I can set you apart or your company apart as the subject matter expert, market leader, thought leader in your domain of expertise, and you're distributing content, relevant content, to your, to your target audience that really means something to them, Obviously, that's going to make you rise above the crop, and that's what we've been extremely successful in doing, both on a company standpoint and training others to do it on them on for themselves. Well, it's interesting because, in one sense, you're really a branding company as Absolutely. well. Absolutely, um, meaning that you're helping me, um, your client, to define their brand um, themselves, so that they can then know who to speak to and how to speak to them and how to engage them in the continuous process Correct. to grow their company. Absolutely. Absolutely spectacular. So, who is your most important niche? Big business, SAP, which is a monster, or tiny, tiny, tiny businesses? Well, you look at, I mean, our, our target market is executives, entrepreneurs, marketing and business professionals. We work with the companies, like I said, very, very small to very, very large. But there's an appetite to do things right. And whether you're a, a solo entrepreneur or a very large company, I mean, like SAP, you need to know how to do things right. And the similarity between these is that you want to set yourself apart as that subject matter expert leader, market leader, thought leader in your domain of expertise. I, I have a story for about a company that's actually based in Silicon Valley. Mm -hmm. And you know, Silicon Valley, land of high techs, right. and, and our company's based in Atlanta, Georgia. And, and this gentleman, the CEO, is like, well, first of all, why would I ever need a company to in, in Georgia to handle my online presence? Because I do not believe that you can get up to speed to learn who I am, what I do, who my target market is, and what their trigger points are quickly enough to make it make, it make sense. And, you know, we, we went back and forth, and I said, you know what, let's just stop going back and forth. Let's just give us a shot. And he decided to, but I said, let's have a friendly wager. And from this wager, we said, all right, I will go ahead, if we're not successful, I will fly to California, and you're probably familiar with French Laundry. French Laundry, one of the best restaurants in the world. And I said, if we're not successful, I will take you there for dinner. So two things, I wasn't looking forward to the flight, and I surely wasn't looking forward to pay for that bill. And if we are successful, you'll fly to Atlanta, and you'll take me out to the restaurant of my choice. And, and what we did do, and he chuckled, and we, we, we had a little handshake, and we agreed. And what we did from there, we took a deep dive. We learned who they were, we met with their people, and from meeting with their people, we established a strategy for success that we implemented immediately. And lo and behold, within 45 days of that meeting, we not only got up to speed, much quicker than they were able to get their internal people up to speed, which takes them six months internally, is that we were able to make their presence felt on the internet. So just last Friday, you know, Stephen flew in from San Francisco, got in his Boy, car, <laughs> yeah, flew into Atlanta, I picked him up, we went to the Capitol Grill and I had a wonderful surf and turf dinner and he was very happy Incredible. to pay for it because the results that he achieved are of far course. more more worthwhile than, than a of flight course. and a dinner. Clarity, 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 clarity. Absolutely. So, the last question. Um, all these little businesses out there watching us right now on television someplace in Iowa, um, but can I afford it, he's asking. How do I afford this um, extraordinary service that he's providing to SAP, which is a multi-billion dollar company, and I'm just a little whatever <laughs> in Iowa. So give me a break. How can I afford it? Well, you look at the standpoint is that can you not afford it? And again, our, our no, I, I, under, I understand <laughs> that argument. Yeah, but you cannot not afford it. Correct. But of course I hear that. But let's get back to the other question, which is the real pragmatics of it. How can he afford it? Well, you look at when you're going ahead and you're establishing your social media presence, it is who you are. Are you willing to invest in yourself? And again, we have programs. The SAP program obviously is not the one that we do for the solo entrepreneur. The goals of that, again, establishing yourself as that subject matter expert, market leader, thought leader is the same. But again, the, the strategies are a little bit Bit lesser obviously for the solo okay. entrepreneur so I'll give you a SAP. break I'll give you I'll take you off that hook tell the man who's listening and hot about this um, how to contact you very simple you can go to our website on on the internet at www.socialmediamagic.com or you can also go and learn all about our training programs at smmu.com smmu
is that you for university you you for university you for university social media com. marketing university okay so it's social media magic dot com s m m u yes okay that is correct there you go a pleasure all right thank you thank very you. much Mike. I delight.